Well, Sean, two wins under your belt here, through to the last 32. You was off to the perfect start here in India. Yeah, I mean, I didn't play very well in my first match. I played marginally better there, scored quite well in the balls, you know, a couple of good breaks and a, and a century. So um, it's definitely in there somewhere. I don't know whether I lost my A game in, you know, in, in the journey here or something. I don't know. But, uh, no, listen... I've played in many tournaments before where I've played better and lost, so I'm um, still here, it's 32 left, and we'll keep batting. And you say, obviously, an 80 break to open, a century throwing there, you seem in your comfort zone out there. Yeah, it's, it's you know, when you get out there and play, play nicely and the balls are hitting the middle of the pockets, you know, it's a nice place to be. This is playing in tournaments around the world is what I dreamt of as a child, so, you know, being out here playing and meeting all these nice people and, and doing okay is, is what it's all about, and um, as I say, very, very thrilled to, to still be here and go again tomorrow. Coming into this as well, reaching two consecutive ranking finals, I mean, that's obviously, is this one of the best starts of the season you've had as a professional? I guess so, yeah. I mean, you know, it's always nice to try and start the season well and, I don't know, take a bit of pressure off, but um, sure, we're all trying to win every single week, every tournament we're all trying to win, so even if I'd won those two tournaments and then came here and lost, you know, I'd still be disappointed to lose. So, it's, um, you know, sports people, we're never happy. And... Um, you know, as I say, I, I couldn't have really done much better in the first couple of tournaments, but win those, but win the trophies. So, yeah, I'm here, trying my best, and who knows, maybe third time lucky. Well, it's second time here in India. Um, do you feel the forms there potentially do well? It must be in the back of your mind that you can carry on this streak. Absolutely, yeah. I mean, you know, I'm, I'm far too old to start going around telling everyone I'm going to win the tournament. You know, I'm far too experienced for all that. But you know, the longer it goes and the fewer players are here, obviously the chances uh, are better for for each and every one of us. Um, you know, it's a slightly reduced field this week with some of the other top boys not here so the rest of us sort of go oh, well, well you know if I can just keep my head down and go about my business but you know I've got my, my, my hands full with Fergal tomorrow you know he's going to give me a real good game it's only a best of seven and either of us could win that in an hour or we could be out there for three hours um, it would be very very difficult and I can't look any further than that. And just finally obviously being one of the more popular faces on tour you're really popular fan favourite out here just give us a word on kind of the popularity of snooker out here and the support you've been having on your matches in particular. Yeah I mean it, it, it's weird because I mean you walk out there and we walk we go out around the world but we walk out there and, it, and it's a full house uh, sure you know it's not as big as the Masters it's not as you know big an arena but what seats there are are full so you know it's really great to go out and play in front of a, a packed crowd who want to come and watch you play that's what gives us the buzz you know there's nothing worse than as a sports person walking out there and there not being anyone there but Q Sports over in India over here is massive. It's very difficult to explain to people that haven't been here just how big it is. You know, Pankajapani, who's sort of the best billiards player, you know, he's like a god out here. And, um, you know, it's, it's very, very popular. Lest we forget that snooker was created here. So, you know, people, people know about the game. They watch, they watch the sport. They understand the shots you're playing. They understand the game. They're educated in the game. And it's a real pleasure to come out here and play for them. Cheers and all the best. Great. Thank you.